And Yura, yeah. I have to ask, and it's the first question everybody will ask me, mm -hmm. where is Borat? You hear that guys? These cafes and bars mm -hmm. are open 24 hours. Come to Kazakhstan. We are going all in with the drinks. A local Hennigan beer from Kazakhstan. You remind me my classmate. He's very attractive. <laughs> <laughs> my memory is really bad. I don't even remember your name, Steve. <laughs> Steve, right? Michael. Uh, Steve Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Aloha guys and welcome to a new video of mine. So I am in officially in country number 49 today. We are in Kazakhstan and we are in Almaty. And I'm with the tour guide today. She's a bit camera shy, but we'll just we'll do a quick hello. This is Anyura. Hi. This is <laughs> She will be taking me around the city. Um, we got her on getyourguide.com. No, what do you call the app? I got you on the app. Show me around. Show me around. Yes, that's it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so if you would like to go with the lovely Anyura and take you around on Mari, mm -hmm. you can find her on Show Me Around. It's an app. Get it. So today we're going to see this beautiful church. We're going to go around the city, maybe some food, some local Kazakh food that you'll never get. It's either Georgian or <laughs> Russian. We'll maybe get some food and maybe a beer or two to top it all off. So it'll be a quick video today, guys. Just an introduction, but I will be going with Anyura tomorrow to the mountains to see a real eagle. An eagle, yeah. And some snow. So yeah, right, catch the bit, guys. Look at this here, guys. Thing of beauty. Made fully from wood. Would you believe? Would you believe it? Fully from wood, lasted two earthquakes and not a nail in sight. Some setup high, we'll go in now. your hands no. or just under it's, it's up to you. It's warm <laughs> all my sins have been absolved now yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like a better person already in, in winter here it's ice ice rink oh it's an ice rink oh yeah. wow we have a lot of awesome. ice rink yeah. in winter but biggest one is uh, in middle mountains it's highest and yeah. biggest ice rink wow, in the world. Wow, wow. Yeah. Biggest ice rink in the world? Yeah, wow. and if we go tomorrow to the mountains, I will show you this ice rink as well. Okay, I can't skate though. No, no. Uh, <laughs> I'm terrible. Now, now I think it's uh, melted. Melted, yes. Of course, uh, they change for summertime. It's just for like rollers. For yeah, rollers. okay, yeah, okay, not okay. Not ice rink. Cool. Well, here it's very nice view. Yeah, view oh yeah, picture. oh yes. Look at this view here, guys. Beautiful. For what? For radio, like for radio station. Oh, ah, during World War II. Because it's high, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good yeah. signal. Good Better signal, signal, yeah. In World War II? Did what? you the Second World War? Did you uh, say? Before. before. Before, okay, okay, okay. Very cool, yeah. right. So the Kazakhs fought against Ukraine uh, no, for Russia? No, officially we are neutral. neutral. Yeah. But uh, because of this union, our army have to serve also and to so, fight. Serve Russia? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't know. So this, there's Kazakhstan, there's Kazakh troops in Ukraine right now? No, we, no. Uh, we protested and <coughs> that's why it's very good that we are not there, but Okay, you finish your cigarette, uh, but still, uh, we, it's, you know, 
this war is very affected here with sun sanctions against Russia. You know, uh, parallel uh, import. They use Kazakhstan to import everything uh, to Russia also. Uh, I've heard that they established some military factories yeah. in the north. Okay. Because we have longest border. Yeah. Uh, it's about 8,000 kilometers with Russia. 8,000 wow. kilometers. Wow. Kazakhstan is huge. Yeah. It's really big. This big ra uh, border with Russia. Yeah. So they can easily come here. And you know that when it started this war, during last year, about half millions of Russian people came to Kazakhstan. Half millions. Okay, really? Yeah. Okay. So uh, they moved here. Some of them, they uh, started to work here. Yeah. And um, it's not good for us because um, it was uh, inflation, very bad yeah. inflation. Also, properties um, become mm. very expensive. I uh, and um, tax. We had before this unemployment. Now an unemployment is higher because um, uh, <coughs> you so, know that so you are <coughs> dependent from Russia. You're dependent or independent? It kind of it's <coughs> officially, of course, we yeah. are independent, but because no USSR anymore. Yes, no. Yeah, Soviet Union is gone. But our country is in very good uh, relations, economical yeah. relations, political relationship with uh, Russia. Yeah. <coughs> That's why uh, we still help economically to Russia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And also, it's uh, very easy terms to get residency, to get um, ID, uh, bank credit cards, bank cards, etc. Just for one minute, and they get local okay. card. One minute, they get local residency. Okay. They are growing in our Tanshan mountains. Yeah. Because in, wow. In our mountains, we are very, very high, and we have yeah. a blue and green. I will show you some of them blue, and each tree, each tree was planted by president of different countries. Oh, oh wow! So you can see and we, you can read. Yes, uh, you can read the, the country. Pa yeah, country president or prime okay. minister. Let's go. Okay. Is there an Ireland one? Is there from Ireland? Maybe. We will check. We will check. So, uh, Prime Minister of Belgium. Belgium? Jean-Luc okay. Din. Jean-Luc Din, okay. In 1998, 1998, he planted this tree. Yes. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Let's go. And you see that it's one of the most beautiful trees. Yeah, really. Nice. Ow! <laughs> By the way, it's it's blue. It's not green. Oh yeah. Some oh of my them god! Green. Yeah. This is blue tension tree. Yeah. yeah. Bloody hell! Mm -hmm. Blue trees. Where would you get it? Kazakhstan. And Yura, yeah. I have to ask, and it's the first question that everybody will ask me. Mm -hmm. Where is Borat? And what happened uh, to Borat? Borat in the United States. Did he ruin the country, or did he make it big? Did he put it on the map? If you know what I mean. Did he ruin the country? Borat. Uh, or did he give it good publicity uh, or bad publicity? Good publicity as well, because uh, in the United States, especially, yeah. okay, in Europe, they know our country. Yes. But the uh, US people, they don't know. And even it's uh, bad publicity. Yeah. At least they know what is Kazakhstan. Yes, country. exactly. Yeah. Yes. A lot of do people here, they just, do they hate him for what yeah, he did? Yeah, they yeah. hate him. But he, in a good way, he he's made Kazakhstan yeah. really popular. Yeah. Uh, some of them they believe that he is real. From Kazakhstan. <laughs> and Kazakhstan people they live this kind of style, <laughs> yeah. lifestyle, and uh, they say, "Oh, you, no. you live in yurtas, you are so dirty, you are not educated." They think so. It's not a true perception yeah. of the country. No, no. no. I think true. most. I think you're stupid if you don't but believe stupid that. Stupid people. They think that it's true. No, come on, come. And on. even they think that they look like. He even they, says yeah. "yuk yuk and that's Polish. <laughs> that's Polish. Yeah, yuk I like your half yeah, yeah, <laughs> 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 <That's cool. laughs> so Let's go. <laughs> Thank you for that. I think everybody will want to know that. Okay, some people they complain uh, in our government okay. against uh, this movie. They didn't oh. allow to show this movie in our cinemas, uh, okay. etc. 
but for us, we know that our country is developed country. Yes. Uh, and uh, we know that we know that it's a comedy. Yes. Something like that. It's just just fun. It's it is fun. just fun. A stupid American comedy. Film, yes. Yeah. yeah. But he's he's British. He's from England. Ah, he's British. He's English. But the movie was American or not? Mm, possibly. Possibly. Yeah. He's British, but movie is American, I think. Right. Okay. He's many characters. He's yeah. got Ali G. Yeah, yeah, Ali G is yeah. very good as well. Yeah, yeah. And Bruno, the gay guy. Yeah, yeah, He's gay yeah, guy. yeah I Bru remember. Bruno. <laughs> <laughs> Let's check. Okay. Oh, people think what we are doing. <laughs> uh, this is Mongolia. Nothing to see here. Yeah, Mongolian president. Mongolia. Natsagina Mahavandi. Yes, I totally agree. Yeah. 1998. 1998, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. Mongolia, nice. Mongolia. This is an easy one. Easy one, easy guy, Belarusian. Russia. Yeah, look, why not? Belarusia. Be oh, Lukashenko, Belar Lukashenko. Ah, Lukashenko, yeah, Belarusian. Lukashenko, yeah. So, this is um, Uzbekistan, Uzbekistan Republic, Uzbekistan. President yeah. Islam Karimov. Tashkent, capital. Yeah, capital is Tashkent. Yeah. By the way, do you know that uh, Tashkent was capital of Kazakhstan? Long Kazakhstan time. was bigger. Uh, Kazakhstan, uh, I mean Tashkent was belongs to Kazakhstan a long time oh. ago. Uh, but after Second War, uh, Stalin gave this part of Kazakhstan to Uzbekistan. Okay. And Tashkent was part of Kazakhstan, by yes. the way. Yes, okay. That's why still oh, there wow. are a lot of Kazakh people living there. Yes, okay. Yeah. Wow. Bloody hell. Yeah, next tree. What have we got? This is Italy. Italy? Yeah. Berlusconi? Not Berlusconi. Oscar Luigi Falifaro. Okay. In 1995. 95, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this one's gonna be difficult. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> we'll it's we'll, your, we'll your forget turn. about this one. Yeah, it's your turn. <laughs> My turn. Maybe United States. Maybe if I. <laughs> Who knows? We'll say, uh, we'll say Ireland. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Uh, Lithuanian. Okay. This is not Russian, this is in Kazakh language. Oh. Uh, you know that Kazakh we use Cyrillic. You speak? We don't use Latin. Okay. Opposite. You speak um, Kazakh? No, we speak two languages, two official languages. Okay. Kazakh and Russian. Yes. But we're, when we write, we are using Cyrillic, not Latin alphabet. What's Cy Cyrillic? What is that? Cyrillic, it's a, a Russian writing. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, these are very Soviet, aren't they? These stars. CCCP, are they Soviet? Soviet Union. Yes. Star of Soviet Union. This is a huge monument about these 28 soldiers who saved Moscow. That's why this is a wall, Kremlin wall. Uh, 28 Panfilov soldiers with the leader Panfilov. And fill off. Yeah. Okay. Wow. These guys, they saved Moscow. That's why this monument they used uh, Kremlin, Moscow yeah. Kremlin. Bureau. Yeah. And uh, it's written here, Velika Russia отступает некуда позади Москва. It means uh, Russia is great. Uh, May, 9th of May, the we celebrate here Victory Day. The, the fire, it's eternal flame. From when, sorry, what year? 60s. After war, maybe 10. The 60s. Later, so what par is it? Sorry? How's it powered? Powered? <laughs> How, what? How, um, is it gas? Yes, of course. Gas, yeah. okay. And uh, I mean, it's a memorial, like memorial death. Yeah. About who was died during the Second War. Yeah. And Victory Day we celebrate here. Yeah. Uh, a lot of flowers here. Veterans come here. Veterans of Second War. A lot of people, it's something like parade, small parade yeah. here. So our president comes here uh, for this uh, celebration. And uh, also they, um, here you can buy some Soviet army symbolic, like this. Hats? Uh, hat, uh, like stars. Oh yeah, like cool. Yeah. So you should come on 9th of May, Victory Day. <laughs> By the way, do you know <coughs> what happens uh, here? Oh, go ahead. Uh, do you know that uh, who put first flag to Reichstag, flag, flag of victory to Reichstag? You know Reichstag? Russians? No, Kazakh guy. You're too. <laughs> Kazakh guy. Really? Yeah. I've in seen. Berlin, in I've Berlin. seen the video. I've seen mm -hmm, the video. Mm -hmm. He's Kazakh. 
he's Kazakh. Very popular video. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. Freak out. Kazakh guy. He's still alive, I think. Probably. Would, probably. Wow, he would nearly be 100. Uh, Almost. Over a hundred. That time he was maybe 20. I don't know, maybe not yeah. alive, but I remember his picture when he was old. Okay. Yeah. Wow, that's fascinating. Yeah. I love that. I love that. So he's from Kazakhstan. He's from he's Kazakh. Kazakh guy. Yeah. <laughs> I've been in Berlin. I've seen uh, this Reichstag and yes. I remember this picture, how Kazakh guy put this <clears throat> yeah. stuff. Yeah. It's, a, it's cool. It's a cool video, actually. Yeah. Names who died uh, yeah. during Second, Second World War. Uh, yeah. You know that it, it's about two million people died oh, yeah. uh, Jeez. from wow, Kazakhstan. Wow. Two million. Imagine two million yeah. they died. Yeah, so... Almaty is the biggest city. Almaty is the biggest city. The biggest city. Now it's more than 2 million population yeah. in Almaty. And it used in, to be the capital, you said. Yes, it's a former capital of Kazakhstan. Yeah. And uh, it was uh, two or three reasons why I moved capital to Astana. Mm -hmm. One of them because it's uh, geographically. Almaty is very close to the border with uh, China, uh, with uh, Kyrgyzstan, mm -hmm. we are not too far from Afghanistan. Mm -hmm. yeah. So that's why a capital should be central location. Oh, okay. That's why Astana, capital of Kazakhstan, is uh, in the center of Kazakhstan. Center of Kazakhstan. Far from uh, any borders. Mm -hmm. So another reason is uh, because uh, we wanted, uh, our government wanted our president, Nur Sultan Nazarbayev, he wanted to create new city very modern with the new technologies mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, very developed and um, also it was expo uh, a few years ago in astana so if you travel to astana you'll see very modern buildings mm -hmm. like dubai mm -hmm. uh, high buildings oh yeah ah, third third reason i will explain <laughs> it's because i explained it because we have very often earthquakes Yes, oh, okay. Yeah. Not as many in Astana. Yeah. Oh, in Astana, okay. no any earthquakes. No, not on the plates. Yeah, so that's why, three reasons why I moved the yeah. uh, capital to Astana. Okay, okay. Yeah. okay. When it was uh, Soviet time, it was two guards every day. Here. Okay. Guards with guns. Yeah. And uh, guards is uh, not um, professional soldiers. Yeah. Just students. Yeah, and, okay. Uh, one girl. Ah, you know, two girls, two boys. Two girls, okay. With okay. Kalashnikov. Oh, wow. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Of course. Let's have a look at it. It's cool, isn't it? Russia in Kazakhstan. Yeah. When uh, I see pictures, pictures of my photos of my parents. Yeah. It's, it was really very highly developed wow. secular country. In the 60s? 60s, 70s, 80s. Amazing. Yeah. And uh, because also our uh, head of country, Kunaev, he was very smart, he was a very patriot, he was doing everything for the country. So, and uh, it was really very good, stable, very stable period. Here we have the years of World War II for the Russians. So it started in 1939, didn't it? So it started in 1939 for Europe, but it was officially 1941 for the Russians. And look at this here. Are we Russian dudes or Kazakh dudes? Nice. You know that Kazakh people, they're, uh, they're nomad people. And Nomadic? Nomadic. Yes. And they, yes. Uh, they had a lot of um, sheep, cows, uh, horses. Yeah. And. Um, we moved from one, not state, I mean, from one region to another region. And imagine uh, it was only one, uh, one, uh, how to say, one, one way to earn, to have profit mm -hmm. to inc of income. And uh, most of the food was meat, milk and milk. Mm -hmm. And uh, when was collectivization after this revolution, Soviet uh, army, Soviet government took all these domestic animals from them and because it was no any kind of other uh, business like trade or uh, agriculture. Yeah. They didn't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. They didn't know how to survive. Yeah. Only with domestic animals. They yes, survived. yes, yeah. Yes. 
And if they take that away from them, and what do they, they have? They took all these domestic animals. Uh, they said it's a, we take it for needs of Soviet army, blah blah blah. Don't care about normal people, and mm -hmm. they die. No food. Jeez. Uh, millions of people die. It's cruel, isn't and, uh, it? And my why I said that I have relative in Bishkek. Okay. Oh. Okay. Uh, because my family. family they live in the uh, north east of Kazakhstan okay very nomadic uh, region Wow and after this collectivization of course no food no domestic yeah. animals and they moved to Kyrgyzstan because in Kar Kyrgyzstan it's south yes they are not very nomadic they have agriculture and situation was better okay better. yeah so some people they moved to China, some people moved to India, some of them Turkey, some mm -hmm. of them uh, Kyrgyzstan. Mm -hmm. So my relatives they moved to Kyrgyzstan. Okay. And still some of them they are living yeah. in Kyrgyzstan. Okay, yeah. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. Let's go. Cool. This is a uh, city's hero, hero, city hero of Second War. Moscow. Mok. Moscow. Uh, Leningrad is Saint Petersburg. This is a. That's not a Russian letter, is it? L, L. It's not Russian, no. A Russian? Is it? Of course. Really? Yeah. I've never seen it before. I've seen all the other letters, I haven't seen that one. L, L, L. That's an L, yeah. right, okay. This is like an R. A P uh, is an R, yes, not yeah. a P, it's a R. <laughs> and this is a, a, an I. N, N. N, 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 uh, no, it says Neb. <laughs> Neb. <laughs> Kiev. Kiev. Okay. Minsk. Minsk, yeah. Uh -huh. I'll guess the next one. Volgograd, hero, also city uh, hero. Okay. Uh, Smolensk. Smolensk. I'll guess this one. Leave it to me. I've got it. I've got mm -hmm. it. M Mar Mar mm -hmm. Maravchik. Murmansk. Mormonsk, yes. Mormonsk, I was yeah. I was just about to say that guys. <laughs> <laughs> Literally about to say that. <laughs> uh, this Soviet I love this. style building. Yeah, it's class. It was built in seventies of last century. Yeah, it was uh, offices for Soviet offices. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And now of course because uh, this star etc it's Soviet symbol. Yes. Uh, but now they just uh, give for rent offices. Uh, there are some nightclubs, bars, let's go, gay <laughs> clubs, etc. No thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Afghanistan. The, the Russians. The Russians were in Afghanistan before the Americans. Yeah. In two, it was like so the seventies or eighties. Seventies and eighties. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So it was a long war, and uh, a lot of local people, soldiers, died there. Okay. So this monument. Uh, for soldiers who died during Afghanistan war. Okay. So how long was that war? I think it was more than 10 years. 10 years? Okay. There's still some things in Afghanistan. Soviet tanks and things like that. I think they still exist. Uh, maybe Taliban's we have. The Taliban, yes. Yeah. Yes. They have American <laughs> tanks <laughs> and Soviet tanks. So with the names of soldiers who died during Afghanistan. Afghanistan. They are all from Kazakhstan. Oh, really? Yeah. Demography started to increase a few years ago, but again stopped. Okay. Uh, statistics show that uh, as a result of last year. It's a record or no? Okay, no problem. Okay. It's uh, as a result of last year, it was less birth than death. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. So it means again stopped. Yes. And raising of this demography mm -hmm. and uh, because inflation and devaluation of currency. And the uh, cost of life becomes very, very expensive mm -hmm, here mm -hmm. in Kazakhstan. If compared with Kyrgyzstan, Uzbekistan, uh, our country is expensive. Yeah. yeah, okay. 
even some uh, foreign tourists they say that our country is not cheap oh really so yeah okay and for local people of course because they get uh salaries in local money local money is um low cost i mean one euro it's 500 tenge. yes so that's why uh, but we are importing all products food mm -hmm. uh, machinery mm -hmm. equipment etc that's why only oil and gas is cheap here yeah oh really yeah. okay oil and cool. gas because it's a local uh we have mining oil mining mm -hmm. gas mining uh uranium also gold by the way nice yeah yeah, yeah it's over there so we have <laughs> on top of the church uh, <laughs> we have a lot of mineral resources yeah yeah uh, in kazakhstan yeah so let's go, I'll show you this building. Okay. Look at this here, the old CCP symbol. Very Soviet building. Classic. Zero seven. Russian style, you say? Yeah. Russian style. style. Built in... Uh, built uh, with architect Zinkov. Okay. Yeah. Now it's a museum of uh, musical national instruments okay you want to end yeah it? okay sure if they are open they will close in 20 minutes okay let's check. we'll have a quick look you know that in kazakhstan living about 150 different nationalities this is again history i will explain you later okay. and that's why we have here a lot of different nations germans greeks russians belarusians koreans kazakh uyghur etc oh. And of course, we have a different culture. Why we have Russian restaurant, Georgian restaurant, Korean yeah. restaurants? Because uh, it's very in open. Kazakhstan, yes, we, in Kazakhstan, uh, more than 150 years live in different nations. Mm -hmm. So that's why we have even German theater, we have in German language. We yeah. have Uyghur theater, uh, so Korean theater, and of course, a lot of different. Um, nationalities food and instruments and this museum about the traditional uh, musical instruments cool let's have a look can i play something uh, can no, i play guitar no it's in between <laughs> why i say it's russian style because you know this type of uh, wood okay this the type of uh, doing this design yeah it's russian design russian design yeah. okay let's go Let's go. Of course, maybe, maybe uh, this architect he had some idea, something sim similar with Chinese, li just little bit. But in general, in general, it's more Russian style. Okay. Some of people, some tourists, they think, oh, it's Chinese style. Yeah, uh, that's what I thought. Yeah, just little bit, yes. Yes. But if you see this, you can understand this is Russian style. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's a hint, even a bit of Japanese there as well. Very famous uh, Kazakh um, poet, also his musician, uh, Nao Shabayev. You know this instrument, ting ting. <laughs> I don't know in English. What is ting ting? Shankobus. The name is Shankobus. They put to their mouth. Oh. Like maybe also you said Yakutia, you know, you could. Almost like a mouth organ, kind of? Uh, yeah, they put on your mouth and okay. make some uh, special thing. Ding, ding. Okay. <laughs> ding, yeah. ding. Dombra, some of them, they're very old, 19th century. It's pretty cool looking, isn't it? Two strings. Yeah, only Just two, two strings. Only two strings, but you can hear very beautiful. Yeah. They use uh, horse hair. It's like violin. Ah, yes. Yeah. It's also very old. We use leather, wood, metal. Yeah, well, the violin's back home. It's made of horse's hair. Yes, yeah, yes, horse's yeah. hair. Do you know what is this? Yeah, these these are in Ireland as well. These uh, stones yeah, are in Ireland, I, I, yeah. I know. yeah. We have a place, the name is Tamgalitas. Okay. It's not far from Almaty, about 100 kilometers. Okay. And you can see them there. These are so similar. How are they found in different countries? 
similar because it won it was one nation one nation yeah i think so wow. <laughs> one nation wow similar is uh, in latin america as well latin america yeah. Like peru yeah peru yeah as well. what's this right in from this is uh, about hunting you see yeah, yeah. Uh, animals wild animals hunting we camel Go take the humble me bag, lad. This is a guitar, <laughs> like a guitar. <laughs> twin, twin dombra. Looks like a bomb. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you know that all these instruments uh, used very famous uh, singers and uh, musicians, and uh, some of them uh, used 100, 200 years ago. Okay. Oh, this mm -hmm. is how old they are. Mm -hmm. Hership Dombra. All, all of them so different shape. Yeah. And different woods probably. And this is they have three strings. Yeah, two. three, yeah. Uh, also uh, why it's different shape? Kazakhstan is huge country. Uh, each region we use different shape mm -hmm. of Dombra. Okay. It depends on region. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, okay. Right. Yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. And of course, of some of them modern, like this. Some of them old, yeah. like this. That looks very modern. Mm -hmm. uh, with this instrument, uh, one guy he won some special competition in 2016. Wow, these are cool. Is it, are they bones? Yes. Uh, this is uh, sheep bones. Sheep bones? To, also we, to make the sound differently? Yeah. To make it sound different? And uh, also it's a very famous uh, Kazakh game with, with sheep bones. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Orchestra, Kazakh National Orchestra. Yeah. This old picture. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Uh, who put a door here? <laughs> Some net would put a door like this. What the hell? How am I supposed to get up there? <laughs> you can see also in Uzbekistan. Okay. It's like a didgeridoo. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wake up, we will go to pray. <laughs> mm -hmm. You see different sizes. What is what is this? Do you know? Bagpipes. Similar in Scotland. Scotland. Yeah. Bagpipes. But we have similar in Kazakhstan. My ex-wife is Scottish. Really? Yeah, yeah. Mm. Yes. So some instruments is really like in Scotland or yeah, Georgia, yeah. Georgia or Uzbekistan, but they are Kazakh national instruments. There's so many similarities, isn't it? Yeah. And it's far it's away. Like Africa. Oh, uh, like Africa. Yeah. This is like a boron. We have this in Ireland, like a boron. Mm. boron. It's more like this, mm -hmm. that, a boron. This is for shaman, you know shaman? Shaman, yeah, shaman, yeah. Shaman. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. yeah. This, is, this is for shamans. For they have this spiritual, uh, some uh, ceremonies, yeah. shaman. Yeah, yeah, shaman. Yeah. Our continent, American continent and uh, Eurasian continent, it was some small, uh, how to say, um, like bridge, natural bridge. Yes. Now they don't have, now it's... Uh, I open. think I think every year the river freezes and you can cross from Alaska into Russia. Uh, it was before, uh, a thousand years ago, they crossed okay. from here ah. to... That's why it's proved already uh, by scientists that American Indians, they have similar uh, blood. Ah, similar Native Americans. Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, even <clears throat> some similar words with Turkish. Oh people. wow! Yeah, and the traditions, as you see, the shaman traditions, yeah, yeah. etc. I love all that. So I love it. You should read books. Yeah. I don't remember writer, but uh, it was also uh, proved by scientists mm -hmm. when they made this uh, blood test. Okay. 
they uh, confirmed that it was similar blood with the people from Siberia, from territory of Kazakhstan. And Native Americans? And yes. Wow, really? Also, they have instrument which is uh, similar to uh, steps of the horse. Oh, yes. Maybe this. Here, there, there. Ah, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> On the trot. <laughs> I like the noise. They use this in orchestra. Okay, horse feet. Yeah. They're real horse feet. Probably, yes. <laughs> I Kazakhs don't mess about. <laughs> they don't mess about with the animals, they just bait them. Okay, let's go another one. Okay. So here uh, traditional music, music instruments of other nations who is living in Kazakhstan. Yeah. Like Uyghur, Tajik, Uzbek. Yeah, yeah. They are similar, all similar. Yeah. Very much so. Yeah, Turkish, because in our territory also live in Turkish people. Mm -hmm. Yes. This is Turkish instruments, by the way. Oh, yeah? Um, this is Bashkir, you know, Bashkir nation. Bashkir, the, in Russia, Bashkirstan. It's like Tatarstan. Bashkir instruments. Okay, ah, oh, okay. Karakalpak. Karakalpak nation, they are living in Uzbekistan. That's pretty cool. Yeah. What is that? Kobus, which I told you. Oh, yeah. uh, horse uh, hair. Oh yes. Yeah, it's like ah, uh, violin. And this is uh, Turkmen. Turkmen nation. Turkmen. Instrument. Okay. Yeah. Turkmenistan. <clears throat> Have you been to Turkmenistan? No, but I was there when I was a child. Oh, I want to see the gates of hell. Mm -hmm. Tajik instruments. And this is a Tajik. Russian music. Do you know Kalinka Morinka? No. It's very famous. Yeah. Kalinka Morinka. <laughs> <laughs> very famous. So this is German probably, no? Uh, nine, Tuva. Nine. No, Tuva. Tuva, the, it's a nation who, who lives in Russia. Hakas. Hakas. Uh, Georgian, Georgian. Okay. Mm -hmm. And this is Uyghur. Uh, Uyghur, do you know it's a big nation? They are also from Turkish group. Uh, they are living in Kazakhstan, also uh, eastern part of China. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, it's heating system. <laughs> it <laughs> looks like heating system. <laughs> Also Indonesian country. Indonesian. Uh, Korean. Korean. Ah. We have a lot of uh, Koreans living here. Oh really? In nice. Also we have Korean restaurants. Korean food is very popular here. I wanted to try that. That would be nice. If you want, we yeah. can go now. Okay. It's not far from here. Okay. Okay, so we've just left a little cool music museum. And we're now on our way to get some Korean food. Very Kazakh of us. <laughs> Very Kazakh of us to get some Korean food. <laughs> but like Anyura, Anyura? Anyura. Like Anyura says, it's very multicultural here. There's not much Kazakh stuff. It's more, you get Georgian restaurants, Chinese, Korean, European. So, but let's try this stuff. So that's why uh, I recommend now you for, for you some Korean because after alcohol it's best. <laughs> Before, after alcohol or after? After. After. This uh, school. So we, school, so we need to drink first. We have to drink first, then Korean. <laughs> but you are drunk since yesterday. <laughs> Every day. But they have a beer, they have everything. Okay, yeah, yeah. we do, yeah, yeah, perfect. So about Japanese. Yes. I, I said that it's another story. If you see this kind of buildings, which built uh, was built after Second War, yeah. this style, uh, they are mostly three floors, three stores buildings. They built by Japanese prisoners. Oh, okay, Ra wow. Uh, so it was several thousands Japanese prisoners sent to yeah. Almaty. Oh. And they built very nice buildings, houses, roads. Yes. To the when? To the mountain after second when oh. second war finished. 
Okay. We war with we won this war. Yes. So it was a lot of Japanese prisoners. Yes. Did so, Japan get did they make it into Kazakhstan? Did yes. Japan they made it that far? So the, so of course this war was on the territory of Russia where is uh, this border with Japan, yes. Japan, yeah? But they sent Japanese Japanese prisoners mm -hmm. to Kazakhstan. Okay. To do some very hard work uh, to do uh, some uh, slavery. Roads. Like slavery almost? Like slavery. Yeah. Sla but not, of course. They are just prisoners. They are military prisoners. Yes, they were punished yeah, for what punished. they did. Yeah, 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 yeah punished. punished. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some tourists, they say, we feel like here is a resort. Yeah, it never sleeps, this city. Yeah. 24 hours. Do you hear that, guys? These cafes and bars mm -hmm. are open 24 hours. Come to Kazakhstan. Also, it's a very popular karaoke. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yes. very popular here. Do you like it? Can you sing? Sometimes when I'm drunk. <laughs> so that's why they, they're open also until morning. Oh, wow. Karaoke. Amazing. Yeah. So some people, they go for dinner restaurant. Yeah. After they, they go to the bar, club. Yeah. And it's if it's not in enough yes <laughs> they want more they go to karaoke until morning i should have been kazakh this is my dream yeah you should stay here <laughs> so you see a lot of cafes coffee yeah shops. Uh, also shisha is very popular shisha yeah for example mata this is chain in the almaty chain mata chain, yeah we have a shisha Okay. And cool. in, in some places, is allowed to smoke shisha inside. Of inside, it. yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can't smoke inside the bars here. Yeah. You but, can't but, some. Mm, no, in bars, some yes. bars they allow. Some. Some not. Depends. Yeah, it depends. Same with base cake. Yeah. Some yes. Munchen yeah. pub yes. Here, for example, in Nato it's allowed. Yeah. But uh, if you go another coffee shop, for example, it's not allowed. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wow, yeah. I love it. Very beautiful. Uh, can we eat these? I'll have two. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this guy? What's this? This guy, he will be walking here later. Yeah, cool. Perfecto. See what? Thank you. So apparently these are little compliments on the house from the restaurant. Look at that. Okay, we'll start with one of these. There we go. We'll try one. <laughs> good. Oh, I don't know what it is, but what is that? So good. This is uh, from eggs, like omelette. Eggs? Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, it's eggs. I think so. Best omelette I've ever had. Really? Mm. Mm. Uh, this is um, plants from the sea, I think so. Seaweed? Mm -hmm. This is potato. Potato? Really? But not fried, not cooked. Okay. Not boiled. Fresh potato. The food is so good, guys. It's really, really good. Let's try this. What's this? Mushroom? Mm, no. Oh, no. Plant eggs? No? Mm. Yes. Plant Yep. Eggplant. Eggplant. <laughs> Plant eggs. Plant eggs. <laughs> it's a new species. Yeah, something new. <coughs> carrot. Mm -hmm. Spicy. Carrot. This is kimchi. Mmm. Mm, spicy. I'm going with the kimchi. Fermented cabbage, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Very spicy. Spicy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Might need the toilet. So here we go. Some sushi. Look at that. All on this side. And here I got this seafood ramen. Right. We're going all in with this bad boy. All in. 
It's like crispy. It's so warm. Crispy. Yeah. Look at that hair. Big ramen. Let's try the broth. Let's try this broth. Oh my god. To die for. Mmm. So good. A wee bit spicy. Oh my god. And then, like, that's a bits of cheese balls in them. Cheese balls! Oh, try that. Do you want to try the cheese balls? No, no. I know the taste. Okay. Mm. It's spicy. Stop it. You're spoiling me. We have some beef. Let's get this bit in this. Both are very good, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Unbelievable. Stop it. Stop it. I need some alone time. Just been on ya. Yeah, more food. Let's go. Food. <laughs> okay. I'm so hungry. <laughs> so guys, we have just left that little Korean restaurant. It was lovely. Not right, Anira? Beautiful. Hi. It was lovely. <laughs> um, oh, and that was 30,000 tenga, so about 60 euros. Not bad for two, for all that food, sushi, four beers all in very good so now and yura has taken me to a shisha bar but i don't think i will try it after lebanon i coughed my guts up for a week i coughed so much after the one in lebanon so and yura will try some shisha i will try some beer so i will catch you in a little minute Mwah. <laughs> <laughs> can you see anything <laughs> Look at this guys, they actually give you a deck of cards in this bar for every table. Look at that, I'll be taking that. What do we got here? Oh, shisha filters, sugar, salt, pepper. But this is what it's all about, deck of cards. It's got to be a look at the decor here. Look at the wood. Beautiful. Nice little shisha bar. These dudes are on shisha. But, but they are racist because they won't let me smoke cigarettes in here. Only shisha. Racist. We are going all in with the drinks. I got a Heineken and Anura got a cocktail. Campari cocktail. Campari cocktail. So we're going all in. A local Hennigan beer from Kazakhstan. Very Kazakh. Very strong. <laughs> Very strong, like man, like me. I'll have five more, please. Go. You remind, Go. You remind me my classmate. Yeah. Yeah. He's very attractive. <laughs> really? He, his behavior similar to yeah, yeah. behavior. Yeah, yeah. That's why I'm seeing that you are like local. Local person, yeah. No right. cigarettes, uh, <laughs> no alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> so Anura's on Ramadan, but she's smoking and drinking. No drinks. No drinks. Haram. 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 <laughs> we'll cut it out of the vlog. Okay, no camera, not, no. Haram, not haram. <laughs> Nice. Oh, even a little bit strong. I was expecting that it will be very light. Yeah, okay. <laughs> we are going to have a good night. <laughs> I still haven't found Borat yet. I'm so disappointed. <laughs> you got too much. So we're still here. We're getting a little bit drunk. Uh, could be dangerous because Anura is about to take all my money off me by gambling in his cards. I have to watch my wallet. Uh, so watch out for this girl in Kazakhstan, she's very dangerous. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm not dangerous. <laughs> she's about I, to gamble. I didn't play this uh, game uh, for a long time, by the okay. way. The game is called Drug. Uh, no drug. Durag. 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 Durag, I call it drug. I think she's trying to drug me. So. Uh, <laughs> Raz. Dva. 
Shri. Shri. Uh, this is the leading, leading card. Keep the diamonds, okay. Yeah, you understand? I think so. Rules. We'll play a practice game. Pull uh, loose, keep the rock. Okay. You start. What with? You can start with any card. You you should take because now you have four. You take two more to have six cards. Okay. And Always have six. Yeah. Until this finish. And start again. Okay. Okay. So now what? Again, you should start and uh, to play oh, okay. with cards which you want to. You want you don't like. You want to leave to me oh, okay. or here somewhere. Okay. okay. Uh oh, it's Anyura's turn. She's gonna, she's gonna be badass. Ah! Oh. What do I need to put? You should put uh, with same sign, but higher level. Okay. Or uh, this because this is leader. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Why seven? Because again, I have seven. Yeah. I can give same one more. Can I do seven as well? If it's like this, you can give. If it's leading card. No. What else can I put on? You can put on higher level. Oh. Of this time. Like that. Okay. Da, 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 da. Because you have this. I give it. Yeah. I can't go. Are you sure? Check. Don't show me. <laughs> okay, take all this <laughs> But it's good cards. But and Yura is cheating. I'm not cheating. I'm teaching. I'm just creating content for the vlog. <laughs> to make it look better for more views and clicks. So shut up and subscribe, bitches. Deep in thought. Okay. She's deep in thought. Okay. Benito. Halas. Halas. Halas, which means finished apparently in Arabic. Halas. Is this an Arabic game? It's Arabic, yeah. Okay. We are getting to the business end of this game. I still don't really understand it, but she's <laughs> keeping me right. Okay. You guess, yeah, what is my card now? My memory is really bad. When you play card, you have to remember which was gone. Oh, uh, I don't even remember your name, Steve. <laughs> Steve, right? Michael. Uh, Steve Jobs. <laughs> <laughs> so, do I have the advantage? Because I'm going first. Uh, you have advantage and you have chance. But, but if, you should be very careful. But if you have a... a I, I have only one card and you don't know what is my card. It's a diamond and I'm screwed. Yeah, it's a diamond. It's a diamond. And yeah. Did you have diamond? No. Oh, you didn't. No chance. <laughs> I'm, going, I'm going home. <laughs> anyway, Congratulations. Not bad. Right, guys, that's us. We are officially leaving. So I'm going to head back to the hotel here. I'm going to head back then and I'll give you a summary of the day. Catch you soon. Right, guys, that's me back in the hotel now. I have left off the lovely Anura, the local Kazakh girl, left her off at her gaff. And I'm now back at my hotel and uh, I'm a little bit tipsy, borderline drunk. Um, so what an eventful day. I mean, it wasn't the best of starts after getting caught by the peelers jaywalking uh, twice and being fined around 60 euros. But after that, it was great. I just put the bags in and met my local tour guide, Anura, as you've seen earlier. And she showed me around the city, it was great. Um, nice places, uh, she was good company and we had a nice meal, went to a few bars and yeah, it was a good time, good wee night. So I'm going to end the video here but we are going to start a new episode tomorrow. Depending on the weather, she's going to take me on a cable car and we're going to go all the way up to the mountain where the climate totally changes and it's all snow. There's like an ice rink up there, there's snow everywhere. So yeah, I better bring a bloody jumper. But anyway, I'm gonna end the video here. I'm gonna get a good sleep and wake up tomorrow and hopefully not be too hanging. 
Hope you enjoyed that, guys, and I'll catch you on the next one. Slam.